it's Kim and it is the weekend and my oldest daughter uh, called me last night and she uh, they're having a they're having a hard time they're struggling a little bit so she wanted to know if she could come over and get some things from my house now one of the reasons why I stock up every weekend whether I need it or not you know I, I try to stock up on a little something each weekend at the grocery store and it's for situations like this and even though I'm going to be giving her some items from my stockpile uh, yeah I still got plenty let me show you what I'm well let me show you most of what I'm giving her not everything is out yet so let me turn the camera around okay so I've gathered some boxes here that I was going to burn but uh, now I'm just going to use them to pack up and these two empty ones I'm waiting for uh, when she gets here and I'm going to put frozen things in that so that's just waiting and I had this um, this uh, big thing of SpaghettiOs that I got from Sam's Club a while back and I had two of these and my daughter's been eating on one and I'm just going to give them the rest of this and in here I've got all the uh, green and blue bags of Sun Chips so I'm going to give her all that and then um, in these these boxes I've got various um, canned canned goods like soups and vegetables and you know, corn stuff like that and then um, let's see over here we've got some chili sauce and spaghetti sauce and I've got some pasta here and then in this I've got some uh, instant mashed potatoes mac and cheese trash bags over here is mostly bathroom stuff I've got toothbrushes and toothpaste and shampoo and down in the bottom is like hand soap and bar soap and stuff like that over here this in here is um, like various candies and stuff like that and um, we've got rice more trash bags uh, more mashed potatoes. What else is back here? Yeah, there's several things of rice in here. And over here I've got a big thing of toilet paper right there. And uh, two of the laundry detergents. This one, you know, the liquid and the packs. So, uh, and I'm just going to, when she gets here uh, and starts taking this out to the car, I'll then go through my freezer and put some frozen stuff in these two boxes and I've also got some extra bags in case I need those but um yeah this is going to leave my house very shortly so my daughter is on her way now and what I've done is pulled some things out of my freezer this is the stuff that is freezer burnt so I'm going to tell her this is the stuff she needs to turn into dog food she's got dogs so um uh I've got, I'm going to give her some of this and some other things to make homemade dog food with. But the rest of this is just like, um, I've got frozen chicken, this is frozen pepperoni, cream corn, uh, yeah, uh, I think there's riblets down there, and then over here in this one is, I think this is a big bag of leg quarters. And this is chicken wings and so I've got this box full of frozen food this box full of frozen food and this box full of food frozen meats that she just needs to put in the slow cooker and turn into dog food along with that brown rice I thought I'd give you an overview of everything that I'm giving to my daughter so I've got these bamboo paper towels there's a six pack there some uh, dryer sheets laundry detergent toilet paper all kinds of bathroom and, and kitchen items i pulled this out i don't use these basket filters anymore my coffee maker is a uses a cone style so she can have those and uh just a whole variety of things snacks and spaghettios and and all this meat ignore my little messy corner over here but so we've got frozen frozen and frozen so yeah, that's everything 
that uh, that she's coming to pick up and she'll be here uh, in just a few minutes. Well, as you can see behind me, my daughter has come and picked up everything. Y'all, this is, this is one of the reasons why um, I continue to stock up on various household items, groceries, uh, anything that we need living, you know, like day-to-day -day basis. Shampoo, soap, um, paper towels, toilet paper, food, everything. If somebody in my family needs something, I have it. Um, there was there was a time years ago when I ran out of everything all at once, including money. And I vowed to myself that this kind of si I would not let this kind of situation happen again to me or my family. So this is one of the reasons why whenever I go to the store, I, I try to stock up, even if it's just one thing. I buy a little something extra to put in my little stockpile that I've got. And y'all, there was, I mean, my countertops in my kitchen were full. And my daughter came and got them. Got all that stuff in, that I had in the boxes. But it, I've still got plenty left in my stockpile. It did not, it did not hurt my stockpile. But that's the whole reason for the stockpile. If somebody, if somebody in my family needs help, uh, I don't have to, you know, I'm like scrounging for the money. I just, a little bit each week. And it builds, and then when, when a crisis comes up, I can help like that. But, yep, that's it for my little, what is this? What is this? Helping my daughter from my stockpile, right? So, uh, yeah, I'll see y'all later. Bye.